Hey guys, hope you're all doing well. Today I'm gonna do a video comparison of two different Prevy shelters. I currently have the trucker model. I got free from somebody and it's worked out great all summer. Got a little bit extra setup steps. I was looking for something that set up a little quicker and the main disadvantage I have is the one was really, really hot inside. It wasn't made out of a nylon material. So let's take a look at the light speed Prevy shelter compared to my old school trucker. So let's start with setting up the trucker Prevy shelter first. Now this is made out of a tarp material. Same kind of stuff as a blue tarp. It's not breathable at all. So that took me around 17 minutes to set up. Quite a bit of time for one person. That's why I said two people, probably you could do it in half that. So just a quick walk around of the trucker. Things I like. The well, thing can't leak. It's made out of material that's made for tarps. It's literally a plastic tarp material. But like I said, negatives, it's extremely hot. So your ventilation is inside here. You can hang a towel or something on here. That's what we usually do. And you got a spot to hang a light. But uh, yeah, you can kind of see out there. It gets, you got a little bit of a ventilation here. You've got a couple inches before these, the rooftop and the sides come together. So you get a little air, but just not enough. <laughs> it can get, get pretty, pretty hot in here especially in the middle of the day. So this one, the whole door rolls up and can be tied up if you need to. That's it, all set up, fully deployed in less than two minutes. So going from the trucker model, to the new light speed, huge difference in time setup. It saves you time, getting your camp set up, allows you to enjoy the outdoors quicker. So we'll take a walk around on the outside. First off, as you can see, it's a hub design on top. Press that spreader down, and you just do the little hook on top, and it's fully deployed. You just latch on these quick clips, make sure these carabiners are fish through on the ends and you're good to go. So it has a huge door and I'll put in the video the dimensions, but this is probably not quite double the space of what the trekker is inside. The thing that I like is a removable floor. So if you did use this as a shower room, or something like that, this floor can be either laid down or it can be put away. There it is, the floor stowed away. It's got this mesh, can allow the uh, water to flow through. If you were using it as a shower, your floor can be open then, so you could have drainage, or if you're just using it as a changing room, you can put that floor down and fill in that space. Inside, got these two nice pockets, so you can put toiletries if you had a bathroom in here, any of your shower stuff. Um, I really like the idea back here. It's got a towel bar. So got a piece of webbing across the back. Up top, it's got these windows so you can get some ventilation in here. Not so hot. Those can be tied back. And then it also has a latch here in the middle so that you could hang a light. Um, you could also hang a shower bag if you're going to use it as a shower. So on the outside, we'll take a quick walk around. These just pull up and snap in place. So you just push this and these two bars will separate. So it can quickly go back down. If you've got windy days, you can use the um, rope, which is already pre-lashed, ready to go. Just drive a stake in, keep it from flying around. Outside, it just says light speed privacy tent. The back, there's no windows or anything back here. Like I said though, you do have the two windows on the top. Makes it very convenient. And then inside, the light speed comes with this bag. 
which goes over your instructions of setup and ease, how to set it up and take it down, which is sewn into the bag, which is really nice. And then there is your stakes that come with it. You've got your attachment here for your uh, shower unit inside. Well, I hope you guys like the uh, walk around of the light speed privacy shelter. I think I got it for around 130. Uh, check the description. I'll put a link to Amazon for it if you're interested. Um, this is definitely a lot better shelter. It's going to hold up a lot better than the older one. So like, share, and subscribe, guys. We will see you on the next video. Thanks.